Chemcast. Hello, in this edition of Chemcast, we are going to look at balancing a combustion reaction. Here's our problem. Write a balanced chemical equation for the combustion of butane, C4H10. So since this is a combustion reaction, we need to remember the reactants and the products of a combustion reaction. We're going to have butane, C4H10, but also we have oxygen gas, O2. And the products of a combustion reaction are always water, H2O, and carbon dioxide, CO2. Now that we have the reactants and products written, we need to balance each element in the equation. Make a list of the carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen on the left and on the right side of the equation. Now let's take a look at each of them. Let's start with carbon. First, on the left, there's four carbons, so we need to write a coefficient of four in front of the carbon dioxide. Now let's go on to the hydrogens. Ten hydrogens on the left, so in front of water, what number do we need? We need a five there to make the hydrogens balance. And now to oxygens. That's a little bit trickier. On the right side, we have five oxygens from the water and four times two, or eight oxygens, from the carbon dioxide. That gives us a grand total of 13. So what can we put on the left side to make that number come out to 13? Hmm, there is no whole number that we can use there. So here's what we're going to need to do. We are going to need to double each compound and then balance the oxygens. So here's how we do it. We put a 2 out in front of the butane. We change that 5 to a 10 for water and change the 4 to an 8 for carbon dioxide. That gives us 26 oxygens on the right hand side. So what number goes out in front of the oxygens on the left hand side? 2 times 13 is 26. Check everything. The carbons balance, the hydrogens balance, the oxygens balance, and we're done.